A desperate search for answers tonight in the murder of a student athlete at U of M Dearborn. 20 year old Cabria Arnold was found shot to death in Detroit on Sunday. 7 Action News reporter Rudy Harper talked to her family tonight. He's live on the west side with more. Rudy. Hey Dave, we just wrapped the interview up at the family's home. As you can imagine, they are in disbelief. She was murdered just blocks away here from the 8th precinct behind me. Her mother told me tonight that she was a standout college softball player and had a promising future. She was murdered. Oh. The Arnold House is full of sports trophies and accolades. Now precious reminders of the sister and daughter no longer by their side. You, you know deep down inside, but it's still like a piece of you that like just like doesn't believe it. Tragedy struck the family Sunday when Cabrilla Arnold, just 20 years old, was gunned down near Pilgrim in Bentler around 1130. Her family says she didn't check in after she got off work around 1130, something all the children routinely do in the family. They went looking for her and came across the crime scene. I've always told my body on the ground. Okay, go ahead. And it was her. And, and it was her. The 20 year old standout student athlete signed a scholarship to play at U of M Dearborn. Her player profile posted on the university's athletic website. As police hunt for a killer, the family says Arnold would want them to choose forgiveness. She would be forgiving of this person because everyone has trials and tribulations. And Student at Renaissance High School here in Detroit. They also say that she aspired to be a nurse to help others in her community. The family says she had no enemies. They don't know who did this. If you have any information, you're urged to call DPD. Live in Detroit's West Side, I'm Rudy Harper, 7 Action News. Amazing to hear her mom talk about forgiveness. Thank you so much, Rudy.